bethegreengenie.com.au and I'm Gigi and today we're going through yet another one of our infamous easiest one, two, three processes and today we're making uh, products that could easily be shampoo, hand or body wash. So what does the one, two, three stand for this time? Well, we only really need one piece of apparatus, the blender. Um, there's two parts to the process, put it all in, press go and there's three main functional ingredients and everything else you can see here is optional and entirely up to you. So, the first part of the process is to use some of the soap nut solution. There's another video on thegreengenie.com.au whereby we made two litres. Soap nut solution on its own is a little watery to lend itself to a consistency that most people would enjoy to use for hand or body wash or shampoo. It is of course perfectly fine to use like that. It's soap nut solution in its most natural form. You could bottle that right now and take it to the bathroom and utilize it just like that. However, lots of people like the creamy luxury of store-bought washes and shampoos and the like. And the solution to that is Xanthan gum. Xanthan gum is used in food, so it's available at the supermarket. A lot of people use it to thicken up things. Uh, oftentimes, most people will use it to thicken something uh, into a sauce. So, that's another one. Well, that's the only one of our other primary ingredients. These are all optional extras now. We have glycerin, also available in the supermarket. Glycerin is added to cosmetic formulations as a humectant which means, put simply, that it attracts moisture to the skin, which is always handy in any type of body wash or hand wash formulation. I use soap wort in my hand and body wash product because it, just like soap nuts, contains a lot of saponins, which is nature's soap, basically. So I'm really upping the soap factor with the addition of soap wort. Potassium sorbate, our little friend here, is a very gentle preservative and one could argue that in a product that has such a heavy water content that it would be make good sense to use a preservative. Now potassium sorbate isn't natural but it is allowed in natural cosmetics formulations. And finally, just because I love to use them, we have some essential oils here and I've been on a real citrus kick lately so I'm including grapefruit white and lime. So the next step is to just combine them in the good old blender, rev it up, and then we'll have a product. Okay, and here we go. And now, for the grand finale. Let's have a look at our finished product. Ooh, creamy, luxury, Shampooy goodness, yes. Oh yes. Woo! Look at the luxurious creaminess of your homemade natural hand body wash and shampoo. It's amazing. Always apply a label. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for the easiest one, two, three you made it yourself at home from natural ingredients. Body wash can also be used as hand wash and shampoo. Mmm, creamy.